and all that. So Keith, uh, you know, we started off slow. This is our first time playing indoor football. We started off slow at the beginning. We had a couple mistakes. We had a couple fumbles, a couple turnover downs. We missed a field goal. We left a lot of points out there at the beginning of the game. And once the game got to grooving, you know, we had some turn, uh, not turn off, sorry. We had some penalties, pushed us back and whatnot. But it was, at the end of, end of all, man, it was a good game. It was fun, hard, clean football. I think it was good for the city. So you guys uh, only found out about this about 24 hours ago. I mean, uh, what does it say about your team? You know, man, what we say, we, we had practice Thursday night. Thursday night, we got a call say the Iron Man wanted us to play. So we couldn't get into the field Friday. So we didn't get into here until yesterday, I mean, this morning at 10 o'clock. But at the end of the day, man, like I tell people, football is football, man. You know, we won a NAS championship. We've been to the league championship every year we've been in existence. And we got a lot of guys that also has played high-level college football, overseas, indoor football, whatnot. So we knew once we got started and got rolling in the game, at the end of the day, it's still football. Would you like to make uh, Iron Man versus Mustang the annual thing? I think, I think that would be great for the city, man, especially with the way the game turned out today. I know a lot of people thought we was going to get blown out. So I think if we can make this an annual thing and make it a fundraiser either for them, for us, a, a, a charity game or something, I think it would be a great thing for the city.